Okay, for the meantime, let's have uh, a test of understanding, uh, some conceptual understanding here. Uh, let's uh, say we have identical sized lead and aluminum cubes that are um, fully submerged on this fluid, uh, on this um, ideal fluid here. And um, note here that the density of lead is greater than the density of aluminum, kaya mas mabigat. Pag hinawakan mo same volume ng lead, mas mabigat siya sa same volume ng aluminum. Now, the question is first, uh -huh, first, which could be experienced as a greater buoyant force? So, Again, the, hint, the idea here is they have the same, they are fully, they, they both are fully submerged. Pares sa kalubugyan. Uh, which cube experiences greater buoyant force? So, is it the aluminum? Is it the lead? Um, someone answered they have the same uh, uh, buoyant force. Yes, that's correct. If, assuming that they have the same volume, then uh, again, the buoyant force will only depend on the, on the, on the type of the fluid, on the density of the fluid, and the volume of the object. So therefore, they will have the um they will exert the same and uh, they will experience pala, they will experience the same buoyant force regardless kung anong object yan. Importante lang na dapat identical yung volume. Okay? Questions. Get so the answer is this is the same. Okay? Mali now. Get? Yes, sir. Okay, sige. Now, for which cube is the tension in the wire greater? Okay, mas madaling gawin dito is you uh, per, um, perform a summation of forces. So, summation of forces acting on Y is equal to what? Again, the object is at rest in the fluid. Therefore, this should be zero, which is then equal to what? What are the forces acting on, on each of the on each of these uh, blocks here? Ano? Pwede kang draw na free body diagram dyan eh. Pwede mong isipin na may upward buoyant force ka, may upward tension ka, tapos may downward. Ang pangat ang drawing ko. Upward buoyant force, upward tension, tapos downward na weight. Okay? So this is simply T plus buoyant force minus mg. So this just means that the tension is just the weight minus the buoyant force. So, and but the buoyant force only depends on the density of the fluid displaced. Ibig sabihin, hindi siya dapat magmatter masyado. Kasi this is the density of the fluid, volume of the fluid, or since fully submerged to, this is volume of the object times G. Diba? So ibig sabihin, nakadepende lang therefore sa total mass nung, vol nung, um, nung mga blocks sa to. Nung mga cubes sa to. Hence, alin dyan yung mas malaki ang mass therefore? Aluminum ba o lead? Same mass lang po sila. Same ba ang mass nila? Remember, then, mass is density times volume, right? They have the same volume, right? But they don't have the same density. Mas malaki ang density nila kay aluminum. Therefore, which has a greater um, greater mass? Lead. Lead. lead, of course. The density of lead is higher, therefore the mass of the lead is higher. And hence, since the mass of the lead is higher, mas malaki dapat yung tension na ina-exert ng string kay lead. Kasi ito, constant to. It only depends on the volume of the object, not the volume of the, uh, not the density of the object. Okay? Hence, the answer here, it is lead. Okay? Mali now? Clear ba yun? Yes, sir. So density of object, volume of object, minus volume of fluid, volume, identity of fluid, volume of object times G. Okay? Ah, may G pa pala rito. Sorry. Okay. And then next, okay, which cube experiences a greater force on its lower face? Ano yung mas malaki yung force na exerts at the lower uh, uh, at, at, at its lower face? Is it the aluminum or the lead? Okay. Remember, pressure is, uh, uh, the force is dependent on the pressure. And pressure is dependent on height or on the depth, I should say. Therefore, alin dyan yung mas, ma, mas malaki yung, ano, mas malaki yung um, pressure at the bottom? Lead. Yes, it should be the lead because mas malalim yung pagkakababa niya. But remember, since they have the same height difference here, mas malaki din yung pressure at the top. Therefore, yung total, um, yung total uh, buoyant force na experience nila parehas lang as compared to aluminum. Kasi yung change, mas malaki rin yung pinababa nung, nung sa lead. Therefore, while the, cube, um, the lead cube experiences a greater force at the lower face, it will also experience a greater force at the upper face. And hence, the, pressure, the, the buoyant force will still be the same. Therefore, this is also lead. Okay? And then, after that, for which cube is the difference in pressure between the upper and the lower faces greater? Sinabot ko na yun. Sinabot ko na yung tanong. 
<laughs> Sinagot ko na yung tanong. Ano lang da- ang sagot dyan? Ha? Kasi since same sila ng height difference, pare sa cube eh. Pare sa cube. Therefore, ano dapat yung magiging change in pressure sila? Same, greater, lesser. Same. Yes, it should also be the same. Kasi while yung isa makalubog, uh, mas malaki yung pressure sa bottom, pero mas malaki din yung pressure sa top. And therefore, when you subtract them, magiging same lang yung magiging um, pressure difference sila. Okay? So, yun, yun yung, that's basically our test of understanding for this topic. So, yeah, same, bled, bled, same. Okay? Questions? So, may tanong for this topic? Wala? So far. Done so far. Okay. 